All right, I want to point out there's, you know, there's certainly you know, a good way, bad way of doing the problem. And uh, what the suggestion they're giving, it's a good suggestion. They're saying, you know, do long division, right? That's what they're saying to do, all right? Now, certainly there's other ways of doing it. And um, maybe I should write that down for you. So if I were looking at x over 3x minus 2, I could write this as, you know, 3x, 3x minus 2, and put a 1 third here. It seems kind of strange, but you could do that, all right? And then what else could I do? I could do this. I could say, oh, let me take 2 and add 2. It hasn't changed your problem at all, by the way. Still the same problem. What I'm going to do is rewrite a little bit differently. I write as 1 third times... I'm going to take the first two terms. I'll write that down for you. 3x minus 2 over 3x minus 2 plus, I'm going to write this as 2 thirds times 1 over 3x minus 2. All right. What does this give me? Well, at least conditionally, I get 1 third because 3x minus 2 cancels 3x minus 2. You know, provided some conditions are met. I'm not too worried about that. Two thirds times one over three x minus two. So I could take this integration and write that down instead, which is one third plus two thirds one three x minus two dx. And then I guess with the two separate integration problems, one third dx, really simple to do, plus two-thirds. I'm going to write this as, you know what I'm going to do in a second? A little more trick. I'm going to factor a 3 out from the bottom. So you're going to get x minus two-thirds dx. Let's, let's do it. One third x plus two ninths natural log absolute value x minus two thirds plus c. By the way, that's a fine answer. You might be surprised though when you look at an answer key, that's not the answer they got. So I want to go through that with you. All right, I want to go through that detail with you. So one third x plus two ninths ln, absolute value, 3x minus 2 over 3. They didn't get that answer either. Let's keep going. 1 third x plus 2 ninths ln, 3x minus 2, the absolute value of it. And then what I would say is, I would say minus 2 ninths, natural log, absolute value of 3, plus c. I hope you realize that this over here is a constant number. Whatever C is, when I, when I, when I combine it together, it's going to be a constant number. So what, what could you write down instead? 1 third X plus 2 ninths LN, absolute value 3X minus 2. Now, by the way, they do differ. So this answer and this answer, they do differ. Where they differ by? Only by a constant, right? Now, what answer is being provided over here? X over 3. And then two times this wing over here, over nine plus C, right? By the way, this is a completely acceptable answer. Depending on the road you take, uh, it's it really up to you, all right? I hope your teachers are flexible as well. Thank you.